Hi, this is Lindy Ortega, and you're watching Queen's TV. When I started writing songs for the new record, I was uh, reading a lot of biographies of my country music heroes, and the first one I read was Hank Williams, and uh, I found out that he was influenced by a man named Rufus Payne, otherwise known as T-Top, who was a blues, busking blues musician, and uh, that taught me that a lot of early country was influenced by early blues. So I feel like this record has definitely a more blues element than the last record, um, and a little bit of sort of a deep south sound as well. Um, I think it has influenced my music just by the fact, the reason I moved there was more of like a, to do a historical survey. Um, a lot of the uh, legends of the um, artists that I've worked with, like Johnny Cash and Hank Williams and Loretta Lynn and Pat Klein have all kind of passed through there. And um, I just uh, wanted to be immersed in the history and not just read about it, but go and actually like walk, retrace their steps and see the places that they'd been to. And so um, I feel like that sort of history uh, was important to me and I think it was very influential when I was making the, the music that I was making. I mean, I'm a big fan of the musicality of the record in terms of the players that played on it and I love all the parts that they did and things that they came up with. So um, I really love how they um, tackled the song Heaven Has No Vacancy. I, I feel like they really captured um, sort of the aching loneliness of that song. and. Um, I love the way the dobro is played and just all the parts coming together I think really create a really cool atmosphere. Um, touring with Katie has been awesome. She's um, just amazing to watch every night. I think she's a living legend so it's great for me to take notes on that sort of thing and, and watch her do her thing. I, I find that she's been flawless um, in her performance every single night and uh, it's very rare that you can find a singer that can play that many shows and never miss a beat or miss a note. And, and not only that, but she's an incredible um, just performer in terms of her stage banter is really great. She's really engaging. So it's really great for me to um, just be a student of that and, and see that. So um, yeah, it's been great. And uh, the whole tour has been awesome, really. So I have no complaints about anything. Demo? 
most want to work with, I think, Willie Nelson. I'm a big fan of him. Um, just, I feel like he's another living legend, and I love his music, and um, I think he's got a beautiful voice, and I think it'd be cool to sort of duet with him on a song one day. Um, my record is coming out October 2nd. It will be available on iTunes and Amazon and most indie retailers.